He's not quite a first-generation driver, and he isn't exactly a second either. Nordak Speedway's defending IMCA modified champion Alan Kent is somewhere in between. Uh, well, my dad used to drag race originally, and then uh, he quit racing and got my brother into uh, dirt racing here. And then when he had to quit to take a job, and I moved here, we moved up here when I was in high school, and we decided to get it, get a car, and been doing it ever since. 20 years now, Kent has cruised through the flags at the Nodak Speedway. His first points title came in 1999, and then his second the following year. His most recent was 2012. And just 13 points back from Steven Pfeiffer, he's looking at another possible back-to-back -back title. Yeah, I had a, I broke down the very first night, so that really hurt me bad. If he breaks down, no, then I'll have a shot at it. I'm just gonna race, do what I can, and try to win. You know, win those last couple of races, be right up there and make sure I try to beat him and, and it's out of my hands from there. I, I can just do what I can do. Only two points races left on the year. Kent has a tough road ahead of him. However, win, lose, or draw, just being in contention is an accomplishment. To get multiple wins at, at the same track, win a track championship, and then just be in the top five, just be, have a chance to win. If you have a chance to win almost every night, then that's a successful season for me. With the attitude of a first-generation driver, but the knowledge of a second or a third, Kent has the best of both worlds. <laughs> I grew up around racing for sure. I grew up in a trailer. It just wasn't uh, at a dirt track. It was at a drag strip instead. In Minot, at the races, Derek Hackett, KX Sports.